Hello and welcome to IMVIP training. My name is Kevin Faddy and before we start the training I just want to give a quick introduction of basically who I am and where I've come from, what I've achieved and possibly how I can help you. So to get it started, um, I'm originally from Ireland, um, County Kildare. I'm 29 years old and for the last 10 years I've been lucky enough to actually live in Mallorca, Spain. Now, for those who don't know where that is, it's just a small island off the coast of Spain with about one million people. During the summer, lots of tourism, lots of money, lots of work, and during the winter, it's actually quite. So about, say, four, five, six years ago, um, I was finding it very, very difficult to make an income in the living. We were just trying all sorts of things because our business was closed down in the winter. and. Basically, I went from almost homeless and I just really felt I needed to do something to change my life. Um, I was sick of going poor in the winter and being basically having enough to survive in the summer. So during a few winter months, I actually I got into internet marketing. And I think like a lot of people, I probably started off, I started off worrying about how to rank sites on Google and how to put up YouTube videos and stuff like that and kind of waiting for things to happen. And the surprise, surprise, nothing really happened. So I think after about two or three months of basically nothing working, I started to invest in list building. And I had very, very low capital at the time, but I ended up getting, uh, built a list of 100 subscribers. And then I think by the time I got up to 500 subscribers, which took about a week only, um, I seen a huge, huge potential in list building. So that was, say, five years ago. Um, I built my list very quickly up to 50,000 and then up to 100,000. And actually today I've got 261,000 subscribers on my list. Now, this obviously didn't come overnight, but I, um, I took it from um, learning how to basically set up a squeeze page to promote a one-time offer, learn how to do some affiliate marketing. And then as the time went along, um, we learned product creation. We've had numerous JVZoo uh, product of the day. We've had many of our products have done over 100,000 in sales. So really, really good success this way. And now, as you can see, I'm actually, we're dealing with offline clients on a basically a higher level scale, the likes of real estate companies and places like this. So that's basically my story. Um, say five years ago, learning how to build an email list to now marketing and basically having an office here. So I hope that's, um, that gives you an idea of what I can teach. And we're just going to start the training now. When I started building the IMVIP training platform, I wanted to deliver a product which would benefit the new marketer and also the experienced. So to begin, let's go over what's required to get started. A domain name, a hosting account, and an autoresponder. Now, these are the three things that a lot of people would already have in their business. Um, a domain name is only $10 per year. A very, very low cost. You can get hosting for um, $2.50 per month, nearly $20 a year, up to $50 a year for a basic hosting account. And to get started with an autoresponder, there is free services out there, but I do recommend a paid service. And there is options there you can get started for $1. Your free offer. This could be a PDF, a report, a video training, a free trial, WordPress plugin, or even a PLO product. Please note that a lot of people when they start off in this industry and they start, like me included, we started off giving away PLO products and over time we developed our own products and our own plugins or we found out ways to give away free trials to other people's products and actually build our list that way. So these all work absolutely perfect and a free offer is something that can be got really, really quick. Your upsell, again, is very, very easy. This, if you're just starting off, this can be an affiliate offer or your own product. Most people will start off with an affiliate offer. Now, traffic is one of the things people might struggle with the most. Um, a lot of people, they might end up looking for low quality traffic. This, I can tell you, does not really work. Um, the best way to build your business in a targeted niche is by targeted traffic. So Facebook made it very, very easy. Um, solo ads, especially in the IO niche, is another really fast way to get traffic. Social networks like Twitter, Facebook, uh, LinkedIn, Pinterest, these are all ways of generating more traffic. If you use video marketing, YouTube is a very, very good way. 
Forum marketing, if you want to the Warrior Forum, that is the easiest way to get traffic to even a free offer or a pay offer, or if you've got any sort of specials or product creations or services you're selling, Forum marketing works really, really well. Joint Ventures works um, once you make contacts. Uh, for those who don't know what a joint venture is, it's basically if I find, if I've got 50 affiliate marketing friends who've got a huge list and they make lots of money online and I've got a product that I want to sell, I can just contact them and instantly you could say it could be 10,000 people visiting my site and we're all splitting the profits 50 50. A very, very um, common proven method of driving lots of traffic to your site. Google ads work very, very well um, in the offline niche and in very some targeted niches online. In the internet marketing niche, they're expensive, but in offline marketing and for some of our clients, we've seen really, really good success with Google ads. And then we have media buying. Again, another way to get a lot of cheap traffic. And if you want to get your conversions and everything correct with media buying, you can make a lot of money that way. With everything listed here, you may have a four-figure sales funnel. You have your offer, you have your something to sell, which could be an affiliate offer, and you have traffic, which is available instantly in any single niche. Now, making an ROI, making a return on investment, making the money is where a lot of people might be failing. And they need to understand the three important things here you have to master is tracking, conversions, and upsells. You need to understand that if you're invested in traffic, what is converting? Uh, you need to understand your conversions, your cost per click, uh, your backend flow, and you need to be able to worry about upsells. So if you, for example, are selling a $7 product and you're not making any profit in the front end, if you had an upsell there that was making $27 and 50% of the people who bought your $7 product were to buy the upsell for $27, it would make sense for you to keep losing money selling the $7 product to continue making money on the back end. And then as you go along, if you have higher ticket upsells like $997, $10,000, $25,000, you will understand the conversions and how it works. So the next we're going to go into tracking and free and paid services that will help. Now I personally use WP Conversion Tracker. There's also a Google Analytics visual website optimizer is a very, very good service. It's actually a paid service. To increase your opt-in rates, to increase your conversions, there is pop-up scripts, exit scripts, there is URL rotators, there's geo-tracking rotators. Now, geo-tracking is probably very important um, this day and age because a lot of offers, if it's CPA or pay for lead, for example, will only accept traffic from particular countries. So rather than you wasting other traffic, you could be sending them to another offer. All of this comes down to increasing your ROI. So with everything here, it's extremely easy to scale up and increase your profits. So let's move on to product creation and making your own offer. This is 110% the turning point for any online marketer. Understanding the basics and then completing the goal and moving the business onto a six figure a year income. So product creation, this can be a unique or improved idea. Now, what I mean by this is if you've um, something unique that's out there, a new WordPress plugin, a new video guide, or something there that has not been taught before, or you, you found out a new secret, you found out a new method of making money from YouTube or from Facebook, you can come up with that. Now, some of the things in this industry, you will see that they're always released again and again and just improved. So, for example, if you already purchased a product or a service that was out years ago and you've a lot of ideas that you can think you can improve this and you can teach it in a better way, that is a product idea. So I'm sure a lot of people will think, well, I purchased this product and it was no good or this product is okay, but it needs this, this and this and this. You can go out and create a new product around this idea with all these improvements and you, that is a successful product. If you want to go into something like a PDF guide or video training on absolutely anything you know, whether it's setting up WordPress, Facebook ads, there is hundreds and hundreds of courses out there. If you learn how to present your offer correctly, you learn how to find JV partners, uh, you're on the way to earning your six figure, seven figure business. And again, a software or a plugin. This top softwares are very, very successful and WordPress plugins are very, very successful. Now, if you don't know how to do any of this, um, 
for example, plugins, how do I create a plugin? You can always outsource this. Now, you don't always need to have a product. You can always have a service. In the internet marketing, you can be doing copyright and graphics design, programming, videos, websites, SEO. You can be just doing WordPress installation. Anything like this will create an income for you. Now, this can be a way of funding your business, or it can actually, you can turn any of these into a full-time business. So if you can't do anything, remember that someone else can do it. In every parts of my business for copyright and graphics design and programming, I 100% outsource. So you can just basically pay someone else to do the work and everything is just complete by a professional. Okay, so next I want to move on to getting your product attention. What I mean by this is making sure that on launch day, all the affiliates know that your product is going live and they're ready to promote it and that you've got a value bird, there's people lined up ready to purchase your product. Now, the best way for this is always to set a date and a time for when your product is going to be complete. I would always complete your product first and then I would add it to the launch calendars, which there's many of them available. There's a lot of groups on Skype and Facebook and there is a lot of basically Facebook ads work very, very good for getting JVs on board as well. The next, uh, contacting JV partners, uh, the correct way. Uh, just giving them a reason to promote your launch, see what you can do for them in return. And selling the JV page. Now, what I mean by selling the JV page is your sales page should be selling the product. But when you send someone, when you send an affiliate to your JV page where to sign up for information about making money promoting the product, there should be as much effort on this. So again, providing the affiliate with everything they need to promote your product. So everything you've seen includes the training tools and support you need to build a six or seven figure business empire. Click the buy now to start your VIP training.